We have the Law of Compensation today, part three. Hi, I'm Amira Alvarez, founder and CEO of The Unstoppable Woman, and this is video 10 in the Income Breakthrough Jumpstart training. So the Law of Compensation says that you will be compensated according to the need for what you do, your ability to do it, and the difficulty there is in replacing you. Okay, so part three, the difficulty there is in replacing you. Now, obviously, we're all unique human beings. So we all bring something unique to the table. So it would be difficult to replace any one of us because we're all unique. So it must be different than that. We, this, this part must mean something different than that. And I believe that there is two aspects to this. One is just strictly tactical. You've been doing your job for a long time in a corporation. You know all the ins and outs. Um, you're irreplaceable. They would have to hire three, four, five people to fill your one slot, that kind of thing. You have so much um, invested that it would be so difficult for them to uh, replace you, okay? It would cost them more to replace you than to just compensate you higher, for instance. But then there's also this more nuanced way of looking at it, which is around self-worth and value that we are sharing with the world. When we own our value, when we own our self-worth, when we communicate that in a way that helps people understand that it, that we have something unique that will help them grow in life, become more, solve their problem, um, have a bigger, better life, and that I am or you are uniquely suited to help them do that. If you are able to communicate that value, then you are very difficult to replace. Someone will want to work with you uniquely. Let's talk about Beyonce, one of my favorite people to talk about. Okay, she's unique. She is a unique artist. There are lots of people out there who are singers, who are pop stars, all of that, but she does it in her unique way and she is irreplaceable. If you wanna go see Beyonce, you only have one Beyonce to go see. If the record label wants to sell more Beyonce, there's only one Beyonce. She's made herself so difficult to replace. The record companies think, huh, I could negotiate the deal with her, and I'm using this, I don't know what her record deals are or anything like that, but I could negotiate my deal with her and try and undercut her and say, you know, if you don't sign this deal, you're out. But guess what? She's irreplaceable. They would lose so much money by not signing that deal that they, then she can negotiate a, a much better contract for herself because she knows that she's irreplaceable and that they want her. So you got to look at this for you in your business. Now, I know you're not Beyonce. I'm not Beyonce either, okay? But you, you what, what aspect of what you do is difficult to replace? What do you bring to the table that is difficult to replace? And if you don't have something, start thinking about what that is. Everyone has it. You're probably just not seeing it because you're not valuing it in yourself. So your action step is to look at yourself, your product or your service, what you do, how you show up in this world, and, and define, identify how you are going to make yourself difficult to replace, okay? That's going to make you more valuable. Just a quick, don't overthink this, you can think more about it later, but right now, quickly, what do you bring to the table that is unique and makes you difficult to replace? That is going to raise your compensation if you can increase that. Okay, so that's your action step. Post that in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Thank you for liking. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for sharing. So appreciate you being part of this community. And I'm Amira Alvarez. Rock it out. Be unstoppable. Bye-bye.